Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be diving deep into the world of Adventure Time and discussing a topic that's been quite controversial among fans, the impact of Fiona and Cake, the miniseries, on the character Simon Petrikov. Um, Adventure Time, created by Pendleton Ward, is known for its complex characters and rich storytelling, and basically what I mean by that, guys, is that it was created by a guy named Pendleton Ward, who was an amazing, amazing creator and created a bunch of unique, unique characters and story arcs. Um, and one character who has captivated all of our hearts is Simon Petrikoff, the Ice King. Um, and if you don't know anything about the Ice King guys, he's basically the, the angry old wizard who needs like friends and he's trying to kidnap princesses. And he's been doing this for the entire series, guys. And if you don't already know, he was originally a human, guys, from before the Great Mushroom War. But did the gender-swapped series Fiona and Cake inadvertently harm this character development? The Fiona and Cake episodes were introduced as a fun and playful gender-swapped version of Adventure Time. While these episodes provided a fresh perspective, they also had unintended consequences. Um, and these episodes have been spanning back all the way back to Season 3, and they were originally spin-off episodes, guys. But in recent time, guys, they've actually become full-on miniseries. Initially, Fiona and Cake were meant to be a playful homage, but as they became more prominent, Simon Petrikov's role seemed to diminish a bit. In Adventure Time, Simon's backstory is incredibly tragic and emotionally charged. The I Remember You episode revealed his history with Marceline and the Crown's influence on him. Um, and if you don't know anything about the Crown, guys, that's going to be really important for the later in this video. So let's just go ahead and break it down right now. The Crown is a magical crown, and it was created by Everence Evergreen back at the beginning of the Earth, guys. And basically what happened is his assistant wished that he could be just like um, his, his master, and it basically just makes everyone who wears this crown be completely potent with magic, but also have the, a terrible, terrible um, curse on them that makes them lose their mind, uh, but it gives them incredible ice powers, guys. And this emotional narrative, aside of humor, is pretty, pretty wild, pretty wild. Um, and uh, we see Simon struggling with the consequences of the crown, and it's, it's heartbreaking to see, guys. But Fiona and Cake occasionally make light of this tragic story, undermining the character's emotional depth. One of the most significant issues was the missed opportunities for Simon's character development. While the gender-swapped episodes had their charm, they took valuable screen time away from exploring Simon's past and future. And basically what I mean by this, guys, is that every time Fiona and Cake are on the screen and not Simon, um, it's really just taking away from all the time we could be developing Simon's character. And with these strikes going on right now, guys, it's, it's very hard to get more info on these Adventure Time characters because just not a lot of content's coming out, guys. And they're spending a lot of it on Fiona and Cake, these characters we don't care about, guys. Um, and Simon's potential for growth, redemption, and reconciliation with Marceline was overshadowed by the comedic escapades of Fiona and Cake. This was a disservice to the character who had so much untapped potential. Um, and basically what I mean by that, guys, is that he had a bunch of untapped potential, and Fiona and Cake were just kind of there, um, stealing the spotlight for no reason, guys. Many fans hoped for the redemption arc of Simon, a chance for him to fully regain his humanity. While this did happen in the main series, it felt rushed and lacked the depth it deserved. Simon's redemption could have been a powerful narrative, but it felt overshadowed by Cake and Fiona, leaving us craving more from his character. In conclusion, the Fiona and Cake miniseries brought humor and creativity to Adventure Time, but at the cost of Simon Capar- In conclusion, the Fiona and Cake miniseries brought humor and creativity to Adventure Time, but came at the cost of Simon Petritov's character development. While it's essential to have fun and experimental episodes, it's equally important to maintain the integrity of the core characters and their narratives. What do you think? Do you think Fiona and Cake episodes had a negative impact on Simon Petrikov's character? Share your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more in-depth analysis. I do these every other day, guys. Thanks for watching, and remember, the adventure truly never ends with Adventure Time. Peace.